Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Misha Sama. And I'm Ethan Nguyen. Today is Thursday, February 23rd, and we're here with your morning announcements. The 2022 to 2023 yearbook is now on sale for $90. You can get one by scanning the QR code on screen. Junior prom is coming right around the corner. Tickets and guest passes are $60 and can be bought at the student store. The due date for our guest passes is March 3rd, and the last day to buy tickets is March 8th. Now, we're going to pass it on over to Damon and Angelina for your In the News update. Hello, Wolfpack. I'm Damon Ramos. And I'm definitely Angelina Duarte. And we are here with your In the News update. As of right now, Alex Murdoch has testified in a court against himself, saying that he did not murder his own wife and son, Margaret and Paul Murdoch. Murdoch is an attorney in a Southern Carolina town and is part of the prominent legal family, who is under investigation for corruption, cover-ups, and other murders. In NASA news, the James Webb tel Space Telescope observed a globular cluster with separate stars. A globular cluster is hundreds of thousands of old stars being held together by gravity. This cluster has been named Messier 92, or M92. It's 27,000 light years away from the Milky Way halo. The first Chinese baby pangolin, uh, pangolin was born in Prague Zoo on February 2nd. The f uh, in the first few days, the female born of this endangered species started losing weight, as the mother could not produce enough milk. Fortunately, the park keepers were able to get enough artificial milk from both the mother and the cat. The pangolin uh, has no name, but it's nicknamed Lil Cone. So cute. The reason for pangolins being endangered is that they're being trafficked for, other, for their unique scales, which is used for Asian medicine and other purposes. Breeding them in captivity is hard due to needing special feed of drone larvae in specific humidity and temperature. Well, we're all out of time. I'm Angelina Duarte. And I'm Damon Ramos. See, See you guys, guys next, next week. week. Thanks, Angelina and Damon. The ASB uh, um, officer election opens today. Voting will close tomorrow at midnight. These candidates will be representing your wants and needs for COHS next year. So make sure you choose your, uh, your candidate closely, wisely. Scan the QR code for on screen for more information. Spirit Week is this week. Today is Throwback Thursday. Wear an outfit from 1999 or the early 2000s. Tomorrow, make sure you wear all black for Friday. It's time to select a student board member for EGSD. Student board applications are due to Mr. Hagi on the 24th for, and there are requirements for the position, so make sure you check the newsletter for more information. The Elk Grove Unified School District has announced that they will, be not, they will not be covering AP exam costs for this year. To apply for a fee waiver or to cancel your AP exams, please open the email in your student view. The deadline for cancellation or for a waiver is before March 3rd. If you cancel after March 30, you will have to pay a $40 fee. That's all that we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Ethan Nguyen. And I'm Nisha Samra. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Banana, Banana Bread, Bread Day, Wolfpack. Wolfpack.